Who's ready for another wicked Funko Pop hunt? Here we go. What's going on everybody? I hope you guys are having a great week. Today, we are going on an insane Funko Pop hunt to two stores, both by the names of Endangered Hobbies. We actually made out, uh, made a trip all the way out to the Holyoke Mall to check out that store where we found some insane pieces, stuff that you do not see every day on the shelves. And then we checked out our local Endangered Hobbies at the Natick Mall to pick up some stuff, including the pop that we're gonna be giving away for four thousand subscribers so hopefully you guys enjoy the video and stay tuned to the end so you can find out how you can win our four thousand subscriber giveaway all right guys so it's time to go hunt at the other endangered hobbies they actually have a store uh in the natick mall near where we live so this is endangered hobbies you guys got to go check them out they usually have some great stuff i poked around their instagram page and i saw they have some fire grails in there so this store looks a little bit smaller but i think they're still going to bring the heat so let's see what they got all right so here we go endangered hobbies here at the holy oak mall and uh right off the bat we can see we got a big wall right here we have some anime pops right here some of the star wars six inch some of the 65th anniversary disney rides which is really cool Coming over to this wall, we have some of the ad icons, some of the Jetsons, all kinds of great ones, some Stitch, some Marvel, some of the Miles Morales variants. Looks like the original Spider-Man box right there. All the way on the top shelf, they actually have the 10 inch pops. Sorry, I'm gonna do my best with the glare. Um, but moving on down the line here, we have Count Chocula, we have Huckleberry Hound, and we even have a Chase Huckleberry Hound, which I haven't seen in a while. I remember everybody trying to get that from the Funko shop. We have some Fortnite Pops, some of the gaming Mass Effect ones, Cyberpunk, we have some of the Batman ones, and his villains right here. We have some of the Aquaman ones, Men in Black. A lot of great ones on this wall. Over here, we have some Masters of the Universe. This is the Target Con one, the Skeletor on the Throne, which in my opinion has one of the contenders for Pop of the Year, and I'm not even a Masters of the Universe fan. Uh, we have some Adams Family, some TV, some Office. A lot of great ones. Great selection, love the shelves, very neat and clean. Coming over here, we have some football pops some more sports ones some basketball we have some wwe oh here we go we got a couple couple hockey ones we got bobby hull hiding over here we have valkyrie on the pegasus coming over here we have some mystery minis and uh over here is where they keep some of their cooler ones on the back wall we have some of the old school batman variants we have that bugs bunny and lebron james as robin two-pack a bunch of other great two-packs the Star Wars Mandalorian movie moment, some of the art series ones. Look at that, we have the Carolina Panthers three pack with Greg Olson, Cam Newton, and Luke Colucci, if I'm saying his name correctly. I haven't seen that one in a while. And we have another one that I haven't seen in a while, the Fui Mobile. I believe that's a 3000 piece from 2017 Emerald City Comic Con. That's a really cool one. And then backing on up so you guys can get the full picture, up there we have some of the 18 inch pops, which are just way too big. I don't know how anybody has room for those in their house, but they do look cool in the store. And then this back wall here, we do have a Freddy Funko. It's one of the Freddy robots, which is really cool. Really cool display that they have right here behind the register. They also have some Pokemon ones hiding up here, a Black Panther chase, some of the flock Pokemon ones. Some of those are going up way in value. So if you guys are Pokemon fans, do not sleep on those. Um, coming over here, we have some of the original Shrek Pops. You don't see that too often. And uh, once again, just a really cool display, but wait till you guys see what is behind me. All right, guys, so here we go. This is, this is the fire. This is what everybody wants to see. They have their glass case over here. First off, we have an OG Sloth from the Goonies. We have a Chase Metallic Batman. 
gold Batman, interplanetary Batman. But look at that. We have a blue chrome Batman from San Diego Comic-Con 2017. And then we even have a pink chrome Batman, 1500 pieces. And it just keeps getting better. We have a 1000 piece pink flock Scooby-Doo as well as a 1000 piece green flock Scooby-Doo. Super cool. I, I have yet to see two of those in one place. So that is really cool to see. We also have a original Miss Piggy from the Muppets. We have some wrestling pops, which are really cool. We have some of the Flintstones pops, just really, really awesome stuff. And uh, they also have another section over here that I'm gonna try to capture for you guys. So they have some Power Rangers pops, um, some more higher end exclusive stuff you don't see every day. Look at these, got a Care Bear just hiding right there. Some Mandalorian pops, some Marvel pops some six inch pops. Look at that great ape right at the top. That is super cool. That would go great with the soda. We have some more six inch pops. We have the Avengers Assemble pops, which are just awesome. Lots of cool stuff. Flocked bulk beak, buck beak right there. We have the Rainbow Batman from New York Comic Con 2016. Lots of great stuff in this store. So if you guys are in the area, you definitely have to come check out Endangered Hobbies here in the Holy Oak Mall. And they have some holy mackerel grails right here, guys. It's just absolutely insane. I'm gonna try to get a better look at them without the glare. Really, really cool stuff. So if you guys are in the area, come check them out. They also have their location in the Natick Mall, which is a lot closer for us and uh we're gonna be there a lot more than here but i still wanted to come out and check out this store for you guys so put together a nice little hunt and uh we'll see if i end up picking anything up so we'll see you guys back in the studio all right guys so before we actually go to our studio to see what we picked up from the holyoke mall i decided to stop into our home store here in the natick mall this is our home endangered hobbies absolutely love the guys here i heard that some of you guys went over and picked up some of their big stuff so that is awesome real big fans of supporting local business so we're gonna go see if they have any sodas plus i know they get collections in weekly so we're gonna see what other fire they potentially have on the shelves and in their glass cases so here we go all right guys so here we go if you remember the big dragon they still have that and uh, we're just gonna go right over to their soda section to see what they have no rock and roll today unfortunately but it looks like they have some batmite sodas tongue lasher the pan am stortus klondike cat savio fair they also have a Johnny Rico, Neo, and looks like one Beastman left. So we're definitely gonna grab a few of those today. Not sure which ones yet. If we come back over, we'll start again at their pop section. I'm not gonna go as in depth because I know a lot of you guys have seen some parts of their store from our other videos. They still have these absolutely amazing, super limited Dorbs rides can't believe those are just sitting there on the shelf and then of course they have this big section with a majority of their pops now most of this stuff is newer stuff that you can find most places but the thing that makes this store extremely awesome is the stuff over here behind the counter and in their glass cases because that is stuff that you cannot find every day all right guys, so coming over here, we're gonna check out what they have currently on their back wall. And uh, they have a few holes because some people have been coming in here and grabbing stuff for their collections. So you guys are definitely missing out if you are in the area and you haven't come over here yet. They do have three out of the four Ninja Turtles. Those are the OG ones. They also have some really cool limited pieces. Looks like Hair Bear, Square Bear, and booby bear from the Hanna-Barbera line. I don't think I've ever seen those before. They also have a lot of great Star Wars one. They have Sabine, they have the old man Captain Rex up there. They have the 2015 Chrome C-3PO. That one's a great one. They also have Black Box Greedo. They got a lot of great stuff and they even have some new stuff here in their case. They still have that Sting Freddy, which I really want to pick up at some point. They got the Homecoming Spider-Man. They have the Patriots 3-pack. 
Now, I know some of this was here last time we did a video. They have the NYCC Supergirl, Big Letter, Darth Vader, Luke Skywalker, Jar Jar Binks, Lando Calrissian, Holographic Emperor, Queen Amidala, and Rebels Darth Maul. So if you guys are Star Wars fans, you're definitely missing out on everything they have here in the store. But stay tuned guys because we're going to be picking up one of the pops in this case for our 4,000 subscriber giveaway so we'll see you guys back in our studio in just a second to show off everything that we picked up and the big pop that we're going to be giving away all right guys so that was our trip to the holyoke mall as well as the natick mall which is of course much closer than the Holyoke Mall, but we had a blast at both malls and both stores are awesome. So if you guys are ever in the area and are looking to get some older pops, stuff you don't see every day, they also have dorbs, all kinds of stuff and sodas, go check out Endanger Endangered Hobbies at the Natick Mall and the Holyoke Mall. So for my pickups, I grabbed a bunch of sodas from the Natick Mall. We have uh, Batmite. I also picked up a Neo from the Matrix. And uh, they even have some rarer ones, some of those really low piece counts. They had Klondike Cat, which I grabbed. And we are not big Masters of the Universe fans, but I figured, you know what? I didn't pre-order any of these sodas, so I wanted to grab them anyway. Here is Beast Man, which has a really cool chase, as well as Tongue Lasher. So we're going to be opening up those sodas on a different video at some point, but I know what you guys are waiting for. And once again, thank you guys for all the support, especially locally. We actually found out that a lot of you guys have gone over to the Endangered Hobby store because of these videos. Um, guys, there are some great people working over there. I cannot recommend them enough. Customer service is always key, and uh, they do not overprice anything. Everything is extremely fair. And as you guys probably saw in the Natick Mall, they got some Star Wars fire just sitting right there, just waiting for somebody to come on in and take those suckers home. So, all right. So in the first store we went to in the Holyoke Mall, I actually didn't grab anything for myself, but I grabbed a pop for Joanna's collection, and this is... The Diamond Edition Harley Quinn Demon. I didn't even know they made a Diamond Edition version of this pop, but really cool. And we actually just got the Harley Quinn Demon Soda not too long ago. So now we have the Diamond Edition pop to go with Joanna Soda. So now for the big event, what everyone's been waiting for. We wanted to do something special by supporting local business. So that's why I didn't go buy a pop on Macari or eBay or whatnot or from another collector. I wanted to support our local Endangered Hobbies store. And that's why I picked up one of the pops from their glass case to give away this Friday night on our live stream at 9.30 p.m. Eastern. You have to be live on the stream and we'll announce exactly how you can enter into the giveaway that night, this Friday night. We're gonna have a blast. We're gonna be dressing up in costume once again. If you guys missed out, we're actually gonna be having a Halloween patron uh, party at the end of the month. So now is a great time to become a patron. But if you're not a patron, you are still eligible to win the giveaway. And here it is, guys. We picked up the homecoming Spider-Man with his Midtown High School jacket on, as well as his headphones. Since we have the new Spider-Man No Way Home movie coming out very soon in December, we thought it was very appropriate to grab a Spider-Man pop that, pop that has actually been going up in value lately, and uh, there's no stopping it as we get closer and closer to the movie. So here it is, guys. Straight from the shelves of Endangered Hobbies. Uh, once again, great store. You guys got to go check them out. And uh, we'll see you Friday night for our little Spider-Man 4K giveaway. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments section below which was your favorite pop and something that you would love to pick up. And as always, guys, don't stop shooting until you score. We'll see you all very soon.